a special treat. I don't do this for very many. I'm gonna open up my high school yearbook, show you my awesome yearbook photo. Pulled out my handy dandy yearbook and found that literally every single picture of myself in the yearbook, I'm pulling a funny face. Um, they did all the club pictures on the same day and I must have been in a mood. And so now I get to look back on that for the rest of my life. I graduated 11 years ago. In high school, I started dating the girl who I married one day. I met my best friends. I love school so much, I wanted to come back and be a teacher the rest of my life. Here is my high school picture. You can see I have aged so much in the last 11 years. Now, Super Smith says this doesn't count as ditching because I have parent approval and it was excused and I went up to a university for my senior ditch day. At my parent-teacher conference, she's like, do you realize that your daughter ditched on this da 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 day? And my mom was like, yeah, we told her she could. <laughs> So anyways, I feel like it counts since the German teacher was mad at me. I stuck on my old letterman's jacket to see if I could remember some of the memories I had from my senior year, but I think it's been so long that I can't remember. It was in the middle of my senior year, about November, my family decided to move. So I got me a part-time job and rented a small house right next to the school and finished my senior year living alone. It was tough at times, but it ended up being pretty cool. Senior year was a long time ago for me, but I remember a lot of AP tests, a really cool ceramics class, and that's the year I met my husband. You know, hardly anybody remembers anything about the year I graduated high school, but the world is never going to forget the year you graduated high school. Hey, this is a quick shout out from Mrs. Peterson to the graduating class of 2020. School attendance, we tried to do whatever we could to stay away from school. Today, we aren't even allowed in the school. Average movie ticket, 371. In 2019, it was $9.26 a movie. Gasoline, 93 cents to 2.98. So in my senior year, flannel was very in, just like it is now. One thing that is very different, my hair is actually long. Hey seniors, I miss you and I wish you luck. Bye. Hey look, they actually let me graduate. Hey, I love you guys, I miss you, and I know you're gonna be amazing at life. But just remember to always choose to be siempre bien. I graduated in 2002. It was a wild time. People liked Nickelback for five seconds. But it wasn't always a good time. Earlier in the school year, 9-11 happened. After the terrorist attacks, people were angry, they were scared, and they were uncertain. And these may be feelings that you're having right now. Self-quarantining might not be a whole lot of fun. But by doing so, you're being patriotic and you're being a good global citizen. What's up, seniors? Cannot believe you're getting ready to graduate. Treat each day like it's an adventure and make the most of it and try and experience new things and have fun and make memories and enjoy even the challenges because they make you become who you are. You know, I was thinking about when I was your age and how honestly that was just the beginning of a whole wide world of opportunity. So be positive, keep your heads up, and we'll see you in a few weeks. Sure miss you. Wish you were all with us still. You came in as a special class being the first four-year graduates at Ridgeline, and you leave even as even a more unique class. You guys have already done some amazing things so far in your lives. And I know that life is crazy right now, but the future is bright. And I can't wait to see what amazing things that you guys will accomplish in your lives. You're the first graduating class of Ridgeline to be there for all four years of the first four years of the school. That's something pretty cool. Be nice to everybody. This world is really, really hard. And if you can spread some joy by being kind to people, by smiling, then you're gonna make our world a better place. And we need that right now. I think I found something that really adequately demonstrates your high school experience. Freshman, sophomore, junior, senior. It's hard being away from the school and making all the stuff that we do, and doing what we do in the studio. Remember one thing that I tell us a lot, let's be cool to everyone all the time. I think it's really important, especially right now. Well done, seniors, making it to this point in the year. I know it's not how you expected it to go, um, but you will make it through.
I just wanted to say how awesome you guys have been. Talented, brilliant, incredible, amazing, show-stopping, spectacular. And that I'm really going to miss you. Good luck with wherever life takes you. And remember that things aren't always as bad as they might seem. Always remember that you really can't control all the things that are going to happen to you in your life. But what you can control is how you're going to react to it. Um, getting to watch girls soccer and watching them go to state, uh, seeing drill win region and go to state as well. What a joy it's been teaching you guys. Um, I love you guys so much and I hope that in the years to come, you will come back and visit me and come and see me. We can reminisce on some of those good times, but hopefully we'll see you soon and I love you. Notice how difficult it can be to open it the standard way. Um, if I want to get inside to what's really tasty, even though it looks nasty on the outside, uh, I can go to the bottom and actually it's a lot easier to open. So a new perspective, all the difference. It's just different. I know it's hard what we're going through, but we can make it through. Um, I'm keeping my fingers crossed that maybe here in a couple weeks we'll get to see each other again. We wish you the best. Can't wait to see you again. Love ya. The turtle from Kung Fu Panda. Yesterday is history. Tomorrow is a mystery. Today is a gift. That's why it's called the present. I'm missing them. And I need closure just like they do. And hopefully we get to see each other again. Because I need to graduate too. <laughs> For my retirement. When all this is over, I want us to come to the football field as class of 2020 in a big circle, arms on each other's shoulders, and we're gonna sing our school cheers. We're gonna be together again. Ridgeline is your home, and Riverhawk Nation will always have your back. Go Hawks. You guys are awesome, and remember, your class will never be forgotten.